Agnes Nazir is a resident of Namaliri village located in Mukono district. Nanziri had to trek a 58 kilometer journey very early in the morning to attend an event organized by Sarah Babirie, a popular radio show host in Nansanawakiso. Despite the long journey and travel expenses, Nanziri did not attend the function or even meet her icon because the venue of the event was this morning cordoned off by police and the army. They barred everyone from entering or accessing the venue. According to Nanziri and some of the people who turned up for the event, police did not give a clear reason why they were being chased. We have come from very far. Some even spent the night here. Instead of them telling us to move away, they embarked on harassing and tear gassing us. Some of the people outside the venue included breastfeeding mothers and others with children who had come to seek knowledge and family advice. I have just arrived, but our principal never told us that the meeting was cancelled. By 9 a.m., the crowd comprised of women especially kept on gathering outside Holy Farm Hotel, the venue of the event, and some people had already paid. I'm disappointed because the meeting has not happened. I have missed her, but I had my own challenges. I have traveled from Luero. Police and the army were also seen chasing away people who were reluctant to leave. According to Deputy Police Spokesperson of Kampala Metropolitan, Luko Jire, the radio presenter and host Sarah Babirie did not follow the right procedure nor seek permission to hold the event. This kind of activity had not informed the Office of the Inspector General or notified them. So they had nothing. Uh, they had not followed any guidelines that were put in place to you know, organize, such, organize uh, such meetings or concerts. So we had to stop them and work that no one will be allowed to hold such concerts or meetings that attract a lot of people when there's not certain guidelines. The number of people available are over 6,000 and the place, the venue was smaller. Police and the army continued to pitch camp outside the venue to make sure that the event does not go on. The organizer of the event was not around to even comment on the matter. Story by Chris Semakula for CTV PM Edition.